Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening to wherever you are in the world. My name is Andrew Glazer, and today I would like to teach you how to balance the following equation of calcium carbonate yields calcium oxide plus carbon dioxide. So the first thing I'm going to do is place in these little, little, you know, hash marks or whatever you want to call them. Uh, that's going to be the location of my uh, coefficients that I'm going to wind up plugging in. All right. Now, remember the main principles that however many elements you have on the left-hand side of that yield symbol has to be equal to however many elements and atoms you have on the right side, okay? So let's just start with the first element that we see. I have calcium. The subscript of calcium is a 1. That means I have 1 calcium on the left. And I also have only 1 calcium on the right. So that's balanced. Great. Let's move on to the next one. Carbon. You have 1 carbon on the left. You also have 1 carbon on the right. So that's balanced. Remember the subscripts tell you how the number of atoms you have in a particular molecule, all right? Last but not least, now we're going to move on to oxygen. And oxygen here, we have three oxygens on the left, and we have one oxygen here and two oxygens there, so you have to add them everywhere. That's what happens when you start reading bedtime stories to your children. You start to figure out how to rhyme everything. Anyway, oxygen's balanced. So guess what? This equation is actually already balanced. You can plug in ones there if you like, or you can just leave it alone. All right? That's it. Hopefully it helps, guys. Thanks so very much for tuning in. appreciate it. And if you can, like, subscribe, maybe even tell your classmates. Check out our channel because we've got thousands of videos out there, not only in chemistry, but physics and mathematics as well. We'd love to help you out with more. All right? Take care.